Hey guys, back at it again. Another beautiful Saturday afternoon. Been going for just a little bit here at the base camp. Got a sweet fire going. Already got some logs over there ready for me. And uh, just getting ready. I forgot my gloves. Didn't bring the chainsaw. <laughs> uh, just kind of rushed out here to get stuff done because it's been a very, very busy, busy week. I haven't been out here actually. It's been three weeks since the last video. And uh, next week is the actual festival that we have uh, out here, the Viking camp. Viking festival we have with all our friends and stuff and just celebrate the season. <laughs> so uh, we're going to get to work, have a good time, solo today right now as usual, and um, yeah, let's do some work. Again, the importance of, uh, cannot, sh cannot stress enough the importance of cleaning up your work here. I've been burning this for about 15 minutes. This is just a little bit that's left over from one tree. There's still a little bit of pile right there. and Cleaned up most of it from limbing it all up, but that's just one tree, you know, and after several minutes of burning it. Imagine if you had to do like three to six trees, logs like this, limbing it up. It would just be a complete fucking mess. So definitely clean up your area. It will save you a... A lot of time of cussing and being <laughs> frustrated and tripping over those limbs so yeah uh, here we go keep going I really wish I had my chainsaw. It's break time. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's just um, cracked 
some eggs and some boiling water and then uh, I guess I'm gonna throw like some tomato soup in there or something that sounds pretty cool so that's going a lot quicker than I expected too just tight I don't even know what you is that even like scrambled eggs I don't know that's weird we're gonna, we gonna eat it though <laughs> Broccoli and cheese, not tomato. Cool. Here's my shirt since I left my gloves like a maroon. Nice and hot. And fuck. It's like it's like egg drop soup with a. Uh, broccoli and cheese soup. It's pretty fucking awesome. Of course, everything's fucking awesome when you cook it outdoors like this. Especially when, when you've been working your ass off and you start to get really fucking hungry. I'm sweating your balls off. That's one thing I've learned. Everything tastes better outside. When you've cooked it. When you burned it. <laughs> like our ancestors. Um... Well, some other things that I've learned is um, is just kind of go slow when you're. Um, I mean, all all of this is is brand new to me, so I'm everything I've learned has just been through trial and error. And um, like I said, one thing is just kind of uh, go slow when you prepare. You know, don't don't rush into it. It's exciting. It's fun. You want to just get it done. Um, and I get that, and I've learned from that. And if you're new like me, it just can't be helped. You know, you're going to have to redo some things. And that that's okay. That's another thing I learned is if you mess up, it's okay. Just redo it and um, prep for the future, you know. So like uh, the walls, uh, three weeks ago, I had, to, I had to, on this far side wall, the new side wall, I had to start all over again. Uh, it just wasn't lining up right. And it was getting all fucking jigsawed and jumbly. And so I just took it all down. And, you know, took me a cup. Took me about an hour to take it all down and redo it but you know learn as you go and continue on another thing was um fuck you is uh just wearing safety goggles in general or, or sunglasses even when i'm chopping shit or clipping stuff or whatever you'd be surprised all the shit just flies back and it wants to go right in your eyes so having some type of safety glasses or sunglasses when you're chopping a lot heavy logs and stuff like that um, is not a bad idea not always viable but it's a good idea so yeah mm. um, one thing that surprised me along the way I've talked about is this how how ultimately how very handy it's come in that thing has come in so handy I brought you know regular saws in here and it works sometimes. Sometimes uh, the regular like hand saw will make light work of other things, but this just all around, it doesn't necessarily excel at one thing better than the other, other than maybe like smaller, you know, logs that are about that size. This in general just does a good job. Um, I found I spent less energy when I uh, just chopped up a tree, chopped up a log to get it down. It's about this big around. I did three of them. The first two I did by my axe, and then the third one I just used this one and kind of just sawed into it, sawed around. I didn't just stick in one spot. I kind of like did a, uh, a weave like here and then there, and then I kind of came around to weaken all the points. And then as I got as far as I can go, then I took my axe and kind of just hit into the, jammed up in there and just used brute force. And uh, it used a lot less energy than just hacking through it with an axe. And energy is energy out here when you've got minimal amount of supplies and food is very important so that's one thing that uh, I learned very quickly conserve your energy being smart how you do things and whatnot so yeah there's a couple cool things I've learned
All right, we are striking camp. I am done for the day, losing daylight, and I'm tired, and it's Saturday, so I'm gonna go home and party with my pack and drink. So, here's what we got done today. Not a whole bunch. Um, I think it was about to right there. And we got a couple trees, got a little bit higher. So you can see it's lining up. It's getting real close. It's looking real good. Got a little bit more of that shit done. Chopped about three good trees out of there. And uh, limbed them up, got her on there, about whooped my ass. And uh, yeah, made some good lunch. Had a good time. Love showed up. And then my friend showed up and didn't stop complaining. <laughs> Say hi, everybody. She's a brat. We love her, though. <laughs> Anyways, all right, guys. Till next then. Next weekend will be the Viking party. They will both be here along with all my other pack members and new people. And it shall be a good time. We will drink lots of beer and worship the gods. Yeah. All right. Peace.